Hey everyone, it's Miss P. And this week's musical story is based on Bob Marley's song, Get Up, Stand Up. Bob Marley was a Jamaican singer and songwriter known as the father of ska and reggae music. Get Up, Stand Up wasn't just one of his most famous songs, but is one of the most famous and well-known protest songs ever to be written. A protest song is a song associated with a movement for social change. And this week in our country, on Tuesday, November 3rd, all adults 18 and older have a chance to make change themselves by casting a vote in the presidential election. Even though you are in grade school right now, in just a few years, you're going to be 18 and you're gonna get a chance to vote and have your voice heard. And even though you won't be voting in this year's presidential election, every day you have the opportunity to stand up for what's right to stand up if you see a friend being mistreated, to stand up for someone who needs your help. There are always opportunities for us to do the right thing. And Bob Marley reminds us of that in his song. Let's learn the chorus. I sing, then you sing. Get up, stand up. Stand up for your rights. Get up, stand up. Don't give up the fight again. Get up, stand up. Stand up for your rights. Get up, stand up. Don't give up the fight. That sounds great, y'all. Let's try it with the music. The recording we are using is of Bob Marley's band, The Wailers. So while they play, you sing along. Let's try. Sing with me. Get up, stand up. Stand up for your rights. Get up, stand up. Don't give up the fight again. Get up, stand up. Stand up for your rights. Get up, stand up. Don't give up the fight. Great job. All right, y'all. Now that we know how to sing the song, we're going to put some choreography or dance moves to the song. And it goes like this. Starting with the right first, you're gonna cross your arms and lean right on one. You're gonna open up to the left on two. Then using your right arm, you're gonna punch three, four. Repeat that for five, open six, this time, use your left arm for seven, eight. One more time, cross one, open two, punch three, four. Then you're gonna cross your chest on five, hands go up on and down on six. So at tempo, it looks like this. Five and six, try with me. Five and six, you're gonna make two circles with your fist for seven and eight. All together, we start with the cross to the right. One, open two, punch three, four. Cross, open six, punch seven, eight. Cross, open two, punch three, four. Cross, five and six, circle seven and eight. You got it. Now let's put it with the music. everyone. Now it is time for our story to begin based on the song by Bob Marley, Get Up, Stand Up, adapted by his sister, Cedella Marley, and illustrated by John J. Cabaway. 
Remember, when you see Miss P pop up, it's your turn to stand up, to dance, and sing along. Enjoy the story. When you meet someone talking big and thinking small and their stinging words push your back against the wall, no matter the silly games that people play, you have hopes and dreams they can't take away. When their words bite, stand up for what's right. People need to be the pond's biggest fish. They don't speak the truth and only want their greedy wish. Remember to be true, the best of yourself. Then you'll be a friend to everybody else. Don't just sit tight, be a bright light. Other people parade around with their noses stuck up in the air. They strut about all puffed up, only thinking for what they care. But if you know the value of what life is worth, you will find your feet firmly planted on the earth. Love with all your might. Be true to what is right. Be a good neighbor and cherish your sisters and brothers. Practice being kind to yourself and one another. What you give in goodwill shall be returned back to you. Share your truth and compassion. Together there's much we can do. So now we see the light. We're going to stand up for our rights. enjoyed singing and dancing along to get up stand up more importantly i hope you remember bob marley's words don't give up the fight it's hard to do the right thing and it's hard to stand up for what's right especially when things don't turn out the way we like but the most important thing is that we don't give up the fight if you're watching this on Tuesday, November 3rd, 
Ask the adults in your life if they voted. If they didn't, encourage them to get to the polls to cast their vote. Remember that your vote is your voice and it's one of our most important rights as citizens of the United States of America. Awesome work this week, everybody. Make sure to hit the subscribe button below so that you can be the first one to get next week's lesson. See you next time.